Hey guys, welcome back to Yelan App. For today's video, we are going to show you how to fix Valorant Connection error code VEN1067. So if you're interested, let's start the tutorial. In this case, there are a few things you can do here to probably solve this issue. So one of them is to make sure that your, all your components here are actually uh, up to date. So meaning your windows as well as your graphic uh, or your GPU. In this case, go ahead and click on search here. Just type in update. From here, you click, click on check for updates. And in here, just click on check for updates here and wait for it to actually see if there are any updates now if there are any updates make sure to install that into your pc now in this case uh once you've done that the next thing you want to do is you want to open up the device driver on your pc now this will depend on your pc so in this case if you have nvidia go ahead and open up nvidia here and if you have or if you're using geforce go ahead and open up geforce now, in this case, uh, once you have the data your GPU, the next thing you want to do is you want to actually change a few things. So at the bottom left, you want to type in the following, it's going to be services. Open it up. And from here, you want to search for VGC. In this case, click on any of the items here. Just type on or press on V on your keyboard. Now, in this case, double click on VGC. And you want to change this to automatic. So startup should be automatic. And you want to start the uh, current service for it. In this case, go ahead and click on start, click on apply, click on OK to confirm. And from here, we now need to open up CMD. Now, the bottom left, you want to type in CMD here. Right click on command prompt and just click on run as administrator and click on yes. Now, type in the following. So, first is going to be net sh space win sock space reset. Just press and enter. Now, what you need to do next is you need to type in the following, which is going to be ipconfig space forge slash flush dns and press on enter now once you've done that go ahead and close this one and you want to restart your pc now once you've started your pc go ahead and open up valorant here or the riot client and see if that solves the issue and that's about it so hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to elon app thank you for watching